Hello, Local 46 family. This is your fourth Inside Wire negotiations update. We moved from the language discussion towards the economics. Now we've completed, as of this video, nine bargaining sessions. Your small committee is working extremely hard to make sure that we push for all of the priorities that all the members have brought forward. As you saw in the last video, we're getting close towards the end, so it's very important for any of you that wish to participate in the process. We need more rank and file members to be on our list, prepared for any bannering actions, flyers, putting out leaflets, contacting members, and following up with those on the job sites. So please, if you're interested, willing to participate, keep in mind that if you're working, you will be compensated for your time off. This is extremely important. We need the members to step up and to help out with these activities. So please send an email to business representative Brian Johnson. His contact information is here on your screen. Please reach out to him as soon as possible because these actions and activities may take place very soon. As we go through this process, the next piece is we need to correct some rumors that are floating out there. Number one, there are some rumors regarding professional negotiators that we've had to facilitate our training. They are part of our small committee and they work with us. Now, our professional negotiators are in support of your small committee and bargaining team. So we do have two of our labor attorneys that are working with us in support of the process. The next phase of this process has been our public awareness campaign. Many of you have seen the article from The Stand put out by the State Labor Council. We've also started radio ads. And this leads me to my second rumor correction. Yes, we've spent funds towards these radio ads, but this is extremely important. So that way, business, labor, community, allies, they're all aware of this process, the battle, and this new fight going forward of the 4200 of the Inside of Wire group. That's why this public service announcement, these radio messages are going out. So it's extremely important. We need everyone to understand the work that we all do and they'll stand with us as we go through these negotiations. The next phase will be preparing for the vote. Just like you saw with the Battle of the Brave 900, as we go through this COVID pandemic, it's tough to get as many people as possible to vote in person. So the vote will be electronic. It will be an email vote, just like you saw for the Santa Communication Unit. In preparation for the electronic vote, we need to make sure we have as many members' personal email address, not your work email, your personal email address as possible. So you can visit the Local 46 website and you can log in and update your contact information. Or you can contact the business office and reach out directly via the information on the screen and please respond and update your personal email address and your personal cell phone number. So please keep your calendar flexible during the last two weeks of May because as soon as we have something worthwhile to vote or if we have to have a strike sanctioned vote, it will take place within the next couple weeks. So please stay tuned, check the website, check the mobile app, listen to your voicemails when you receive a robodial and check the website on a regular basis. Keep it in mind, the contract expires on the 31st, Memorial Day weekend, so our goal is to reach an agreement and have the vote the week prior to the holiday. So please be prepared. When the call comes out, we need you to answer and step up and we need as many people to vote as possible. So stay tuned for the updates. Thank you for your time, stay safe, and we'll see you soon.